Shirt. I forgot my shirt. Oh, what am I gonna do? I forgot his shirt. <laughs> Dave, what are, you, what are you driving this this trash for? I'm I, just totally kidding. I'd forget my shirt a lot too if I was sexy as fuck. What are you driving this? My car's in the shop. Yeah, I know. What happened to it? I was missing you because you left. Decided to not want to work for me anymore. That's so sweet. Who is cooler? Oh, I would say Scott is way cooler because his temperature runs runs lower. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think Todd's cooler because you like him more. So that Jesus. probably makes him cooler. Okay. Who does David like more? Todd, I already said that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's true. I think you like us equally. Nah, I actually like you guys equally. Really? Yeah. That's, that's, <laughs> Todd. <laughs> that's bullshit. No, it's true. It's true. So you and Todd normally trade like fitness tips left and right? Yeah. But who, how do you think Todd got in the shape he is today? It's like my little sculpture I molded by myself. We're going to turn Todd into a huge ice cream sundae. How are you feeling? I can't believe I'm getting $10,000 for this. You are not. <laughs> next chocolate. Next chocolate layer. Jesus. Jesus. You look actually really appetizing. And now the cherry on top. This looks so good. Hey, Why am I doing this for your fucking video? <laughs> this is my first taste of Todd. There's grass in this one. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of funny. Mm. <laughs> mm. Can I have a bite? What do you taste like, Todd? <laughs> I taste nice and salty. How about you, but Jason getting waxed kind of turned me on. Yeah, I know. It makes me want to see you get waxed. So we have nothing to wax. My butthole. Yeah, but I oh. like it, Harry. <laughs> Why do you want to get David's name? Because he's my friend. He's nice, kind, caring. He's always there for me. Bingo. Hey, Todd. Oh, you. <laughs> <laughs> Were you mad? What would David Dobrik do? <laughs> well, the timing is perfect. <laughs> Shoot you in the fucking leg. Yeah, you would. Uh, what the fuck? No, you no. <laughs> Am I upset? Yes. Am I pissed? Yeah. Do I still love him? Of course. We're good. We're even. We're even. Okay. Oh, we're good. We're good. Oh, Julia White. Oh, Julia White. Hey. Don't, don't want to embarrass me in front of your friends, but um, can you start taking shits in the office bathroom? Because every time you take them in my bathroom, there's just skid marks all over the place. Yeah, I feel most comfortable in your bathroom. I know. I got home. But then when I get there, I go, what the fuck is that? Get ready for it. Million dollar hat collection. Have you heard of this one? <laughs> no, I've never heard of this trend. Are you sure? Yes. Wow, well, I would think you would have heard of this trend, David, since you wear hats all the time. I didn't have no idea. What's the trend? So pretty much exposing your collection of hats. It's just automatically worth a million dollars? I have a lot of sweat and blood and tears in these hats. Really? A really nice hat. I kind of understand why it's worth $100,000. Mm -hmm. I think this is sheep's fur on the inside to insulate during the winter. It has your initials embroidered in it yes. too. Yeah. I can't show the audience because then you'll know Todd's real name, Gerard Butler. Shut up. Yes. Stop. Okay, so right here. Wow. Is a red beanie similar to this one? Oh, I didn't even. <laughs> Tyler and Joseph did not wear this, but you know, he could have. Guys, if you haven't caught on yet, Todd is a 26 year old man that is obsessed with another 26 year old man. He's 28. He's 28? Yeah. He's your age, and you're just like upset with him. Regardless, this is his hat. Uh, well, this is the, the hat that he kind of wears, and Todd mimicked it. How much is this one worth? About $250,000. We're already at $350,000. Yes. Next item is a green beanie. This, this one's worn by Todd. It's a little cheaper because it's run down. Originally, it would go for $800,000, yeah. but now it's yeah. only worth $10,000. It's been through a lot. It does have a different scent to it, kind of something that gives it a little more Juice, I would say. This white gothic yeah. mocha's hat. Now this is perfect for a day with Leonardo DiCaprio. Eastern European models on a jagan. On a jagan. I love the jagan. On a gigantic yacht. Gigantic yacht. How Amazing. much do you think that's worth? This one's forty thousand dollars. You can just tell when you hold these hats in your hand. You can just tell that it's something else. I'll smell it. Yeah, I mean, it, uh, you, you guys, normal hats don't smell like this. It screams lobster. It's, it screams prestige. prestige. It screams the president of the United States would wear this hat. I'm not the current one. Barack, he has style, so he would wear that. Can I tell you a quick story about this hat? Of course. So one time, I was at a 21 Pilots concert in 2014 at the Palladium in Hollywood. Tyler Joseph's crowd surfing, and he's singing, right? He's bending down. Uh -huh. And I'm grabbing his boot like this, and I'm like, Tyler! I'm like, waving my head up, he grabs my hat, and he's singing, holding on to you with my hat Oh, actually? Dead. Ass. And that's why it's a million dollar hat collection. And Tyler throws the hat down, another gentleman grabs the hat, and I grab it, and he's fighting me for my own hat. And I'm like, what are you doing? He's like, Tyler gave me the hat. I'm like, it's my hat. And I fucking boom, I got my hat back. And if you can feel right here, you guys can't feel it right here, but there's a little bend yeah. in the hat where it's broken. I felt that when I was holding it. That? that was from a little shit trying to steal my hat. It's amazing. It's just 
so incredible that you know. I get to sit with a guy who has so much history behind all these hats. Yes. Why are your hands so sweaty? I'm nervous around you. It's actually Todd's girlfriend. Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah, we should start two channels. Us three podcasts. Joe can run it. He can have a little segment in the middle of it, so that's how he gets paid. You know, he has a little chance I'm sorry, to speak. I'm sorry. How many seconds do I get? Forty-five. Wow. Yeah, would you lot. be down for that? I actually would. And we should film it in a steam room. Steam room would be cool. Tell us. You story. only do it while you're having sex. So, while well, you're having sex, podcast. There he is, guys. He finally got his Chipotle steak, and I want to check. We can't win tonight, guys. See, Dave. Okay, fine. Game today. You get one bottle flip. You miss it, you get shot, you get it, you get a thousand bucks. Uh, <laughs> Good luck. I won't, I won't. He's too worried about running away. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Congratulations! There you go, man! I like surprising my friends with different kinds of animals. I'm here with Brian, and he has a baby bear! <laughs> Literally a teddy bear, and it's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Have you ever handled a cobra? <laughs> Are you allergic to bee stings? <laughs> okay, here we go. It's going in your hand. What do you mean? But be careful, Todd. Uh, what does it feel like? A fucking platypus, I don't know. Check this out, ready? Yeah. Here we go. He looks like a teddy bear. <gasps> oh my god! Dude, he's kind of frightening. He's so cute! Dude, isn't he cute? Oh my god. <laughs> now come, now we're gonna meet his dad. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Are those Brookside Acai? And I knew you were going to see those. There's a wrapper right there. I'm like, God damn it. I have to hide my Brookside Acai berries. <laughs> Where are them? Where are they? You can't have those around, man. I know. I like to eat them late. You go crazy with them. That's like your guilty pleasure. You just go like a little mad dad. You see them and you go, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let me tell you. My guilty pleasure is a night of Gossip Girl, some wine, jalapeno chips, and Brookside Acai berries. Oh! Isn't that amazing? So David and I got really bored. We called an Uber and we're going across the LA River. And we're going literally like <laughs> 10 feet. We're gonna try to skateboard down. Yeah, left, yeah, yeah, left, yeah, left. yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't think we're gonna go fast. We're yeah, hoping, hopefully, it's we're hoping we go fast. Yeah. Rivers it's, have to travel downhill. It's that's, pretty downhill. That's it's, my like, it's like a small slant. Baby. I'm with David. California love. Our boosted boards ran out of battery, so we're 
Shredding normal style. <laughs> we're not pro, but we're pretty close. Man, we need to get in trouble. <laughs> Should we just squeeze through? On video. Dobrik trespassing. Uh, oh god. California. So how does it feel to be a felon? A future felon. Future felon. Dude, I honestly think we may actually get in trouble. <laughs> That's why I'm here, because I wanna I wanna catch some cop stuff on camera. Watch out, Dave. That's right. Hit it, hit it, go for it. Okay. Go, go, go. California! <laughs> yeah! Get it, Dave, yeah! Oh no! No, no, no! 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 <laughs> Todd, hop no! In. Hop in, I'll buy you the no. parachute. I'll buy you the no, parachute. No, where's that? Where's Todd, it? It's right no. here. No! I'm not getting that. Todd, you get it. Todd. Get it. I don't know how to... <laughs> Go get it. I'll hold your camera. Todd. Take your shoes off. Todd, I'm not getting in the water. That's terrifying. It Todd. smells so bad. No, can you just leave your friend? Please go get it. Todd. You... Todd. Todd There's no slant. What are we doing? <laughs> David's trying to get me to go in the water. For 10 grand and I said no. Is it against the wall? Yeah, go, go, jump, jump. I'm not gonna jump in. I'll get sick. Todd, I'll shout out your Instagram if you get my board. Todd, can you please go get it? Can you show my Instagram? Oh, Todd, if you jump in, I'm gonna shout out your Instagram. Okay. <laughs> no way. No, no. Ah! You have to like, actually jump in. I don't wanna jump in. Let's do it. Ready? I'm not jumping in. Todd, right, can you please go get it? I'm, I have so many electronics on me right now, I can't break them. No, you're just using it. Come on, come this way. Oh my god. Oh my god. It literally stopped in the dirt pile. <laughs> no! I'm not kidding, that. Why not? You have to get that. I don't want to go in there. You've been recording this whole time? Yeah. Oh my gosh. David's board got stuck. And he's gonna have to go in and get it. Alright guys, to recap, uh, David and I, we, we made it down here. Um, but as we're skating down the big ramp, David lost his board into the river. And I went to get it, and then we lost it again, because... Uh, Stupid. It's not worth it. I don't want to talk about it. But at least we have this killer view and this killer river, right? Oh wait, let me let me make this clear. He was he was the idiot that couldn't control the board down the uh, down the you ramp. You know how fast I was going to. The and then he lost it in there. He's going like 300 miles per hour. Yeah, I'm sure. Looks so cute. Little five-pack shadow.